Hi folks, we're picking up this demonstration several days later, so you're moving on to what I believe is video 9. I think that we should be on video 9. And we are dealing with a true life case study working with a client. Um, this client has allowed me to present this small business presentation with Kraken for you. So you can see the process of using the current version of Kraken, which is Kraken 1.0. Um, this is the website, Flora Live. Um, obviously, hopefully, all of you know that using a flash intro or intro like this is bad for SEO results. Okay, it's very beautiful. Once you skip the intro, it moves to this site. Um, several reasons it's bad. Um, when you, uh, hopefully, you already know this when you view page source. He does have some keywords on the flash intro. But you need to have the keywords that are in the visible text of the page. That is a ranking factor, and it still is a ranking factor even with all the changes. So hopefully you understand that. Um, let's go ahead and skip the intro. I wanted to talk to you, since this is a real live case study, um, I'm going to skip the intro. Since this is a live case study, um, I'm going to tell you that I've talked to Dr. Brent, there's this little video here, and had an, a very extensive conversation with his developer, who he has out of Los Angeles, or I think California, um, and the developer ended up being very skilled at what he does. He understands what we're about, he actually understands search, and actually took part in the development of the, of the search engine that was later purchased by Yahoo, unfortunately. Um, and he really was amazed by what the Kraken application could do. And my point here is that when I'm working with a client, I'm an online business business advisor, not merely an SEO and a keyword research expert. What you need to do um, is discuss with the client what it is that they really want, and um, you know, tell me what you want, and I'll show you how to get it. And the reality is, is that Dr. Brandt wants to create a new world religion around um, flowers and essential flowers or uncut flower essences. I have tried this product, and it does have an effect. Um, so I can see why he has such a huge fan base. But the bottom line is that there's more to consider than just um, SEO. And you have to you know, get into the head of your client, find out what they're really trying to accomplish. That's, more, that's above and beyond the call of duty to do that. But in the end, when you offer all the products and services um, that you can back end with, in the end, it's always better just to give everything that you have. For example, if you know that a client only has thirty or $35,000, for an entire rollout of an entire business, including operational procedure, then you can be very careful with how you spend that money and you'll have a longer term relationship with that client. And in this case, um, he does have a limited budget. And therefore, the resolution that the developer and I came to had to do with the three step rollout process. Get a site up, um, put, you know, because the whole process is putting this whole system into a content management site. And then the next step of that rollout will be to develop uh, the ranking strategies and the marketing, and then um, finally later on a social media rollout campaign, uh, hopefully involving my social media company, has to do with the social butterfly effect, which also uses Kraken to guide the keywords along. So in the end, I'm going to have a long-term value relationship with this client by, instead of just you know mapping out a giant blueprint, I was able to find out what he really wanted, and so that's what I really wanted to express to you in this video. Let's remind ourselves where we are. We're going to go ahead and. We're still in the VOMA phase, and we haven't even made it out. We're almost 10 videos in. We've never even made it to phase one. And that is the point. I want you to understand that that's a key factor in what it is that we're doing. And uh, we've learned that essentially the most valuable takeaway in this so far is that Edward Bach is more valuable. Uh, or I'm sorry. Um, I think we found out that Dr. Bach that Edward Bach is more valuable than Dr. Bach. The reason you're seeing a difference in total search market value here is because we have 29 words on the page with Dr. Bach and Edward Bach. Okay, so you got, um, you do have more traffic with Dr. Bach and you, and you have more queries, but that it's much more valuable term and more surgically targeted. Now in order to get the reminder, you know, of just Dr. Bach by itself, you can just click on Dr. Bach. And really this doesn't get that much traffic either. It's less than a query per day on the um, searches, you know. But that's not a huge takeaway on our marketing so far. Let's go back to the view all themes for this cluster. But it was enough. Uh, and what I wanted to interject with this video is that I found out a lot about the client. He has a limited budget. And remember, the larger the site you roll out with the more topics and themes, the more expensive the rollout is. If a client has a maximum of $30,000 budget and they're trying to build an entire empire, don't create a site for them that's going to cost them $20,000 to provide content for. When I come back, I'll show you uh, where we're going with this particular client and why.